summer 1940. The math seemed impossible. The Luftwaffe had 2,500 modern aircraft ready to darken the skies. The Royal Air Force was outnumbered, exhausted, and alone. On paper, the invasion of Britain was inevitable. The German pilots were confident they had superior numbers, they had superior tactics. But as they crossed the English Channel, they faced a terrifying anomaly. No matter where the Germans flew, the British were already there. Not searching, not patrolling, waiting. It wasn't a miracle, it was asymmetry. While Hermann Goering focused on the quantity of bombers, Air Chief Marshal Dowding built a quality of information. The chain home radar system. Here lies the tactical contrast that decided the war. The Luftwaffe fighters were flying blind, wasting precious fuel and pilot endurance on constant sweeps. The RF pilots, they sat on the ground. Engines cold, sipping tea. They didn't waste a drop of fuel until the radar operators gave the vector. The doubting system turned the battle into a trap. It allowed a small force to be everywhere. The large force was. The Germans were a heavyweight boxer, swinging wildly in the dark. The British were a sniper with night vision. Germany brought 2,500 planes to the fight. But they failed to conquer the island because they lacked the one weapon that mattered most, sight. <laughs>